Hello everybody, welcome to the video. Uh, we've got an absolutely amazing, amazing build to show you here. I'm just going to pull up the guy's name. It is Thomas Christofiak, if I'm saying that right. I do apologise if I'm not, but check this out. It's like an, it's like a, how do I put it, it's like a, it's like an art installation really, isn't it? It's not so much of a base as just like what you can do with the engineering and stuff like that in the game. I think this is absolutely brilliant. Uh, there's not really much of a base to show you around, but what I'm going to do is I'm going to flip into camera mode and we're going to go have a look because this is absolutely stunning. I mean, you can see it behind me like that. It just looms over in the distance. But yeah, absolutely brilliant. So we're just going to have a little bit of a walk around it and then we'll flip into camera mode and then we will actually have a proper look at it but check that out look at the lighting on that that's fantastic absolutely brilliant still trying to figure out how he's done it there's a lot of wall panels in there and everything like that oh, I do love it I think it's brilliant the way he's used them pods in the middle and everything like that I mean look at it absolutely fantastic used all them uh, what do they look like I don't know if they're uh, moon poles yeah I think they are out there all the moon poles in the middle brilliant absolutely brilliant I don't really know what to say about this base other than that it's just I'm wowed by it absolutely wowed by it he popped this up on the creators club and I've been absent for a couple of weeks because I've opened a new business and it has just drained the life out of me. So I've not been here, unfortunately, to do it. But I'm hoping to rectify that and get cracking on with some videos now that we, uh, now that we've got settled and sorted at work. And I thought, if I'm going to crack on, let's do something stunning to start with. And just look at it. Absolutely fantastic. Very, very clever. I'm assuming that a lot of this has been glitch built in. Looks like it, doesn't it, to get the angles that he's got. But we'll have a we'll have a bit of a camera mode round it, and uh, we'll get a look at it from all the different angles that it is. Because I'm absolutely wowed by this. Right, here we go. I mean, look at this. Absolutely stunning. Look at that. Must have taken him absolutely ages to do that. Very good build, my friend. Very, very good build. You can see here, look. I do like the fact that it's on one of these deserted planets as well. Gives the whole thing like a, a monolith feel, doesn't it? Like it's some sort of ancient structure that's been left there. And we've discovered it. Oh, well done. Absolutely well done. So it's cargo pods in the middle, moon poles. He's built the original base up like that. I'm interested in looking at this bit at the top, actually, and how he's lit it. Let's go and have a close, closer look. Ah, I see how he's done it. Very cool. Very, very, very cool. That almost looks like a face at the top, doesn't it? some sort of ancient alien structure beckoning you activating it's probably not a good idea I don't know is there any mythology or is there anything behind this I'd be interested to know uh, what your approach to it was and also what your idea was behind it because this is fantastic have we got wiring all the way around these is that what we've done or is that just that no it's not is it it must have used wire placement to get those in but yeah, absolutely brilliant. Look at that. It goes to show, I think, that you don't always have to build something functional. I've never really got into the to the mindset of building things like this, but I'm thinking in the new year that I might have a go at stuff like this. Because I'd be interested to see what you can come up with. I'd be interested in touring more bases like this, to be honest. But look at that. Let's just get the sun behind it. Oh, fantastic. And I do like the fact that the planet's got these weird, sort of like Guardian of Forever Star Trek rings on it and stuff like that. Very, very cool, sir. How long did it take you to build this? 
I'd be very interested to know. I mean, look at that. Absolutely fantastic. Well done, sir. There you go. I'll just zoom out a little bit so you can all see it like that. But the sky works fantastically behind it. Look at that. Absolutely brilliant. Well done. I'm really impressed with that. Let's put the sun in the middle of it like that, look. <laughs> there we go. How awesome's that? That's in creative mode, guys. So this has been done in creative mode. I'll uh, let's we'll see if pulling the glyphs up or something like that. So yeah, creative mode. It's in Euclid. Very, very cool. Very, very cool. So, let's see if we can get some glyphs up for this. There we go. So if you want to do the glyphs, it is the mirror face twice, it's a bird, it's a cube, it's the triforce, then a dragonfly, then a moon, then a TP, then a bug, then another moon, then another dragonfly, and then the boat. It's in creative mode, and it is in the Euclid galaxy, and it is well worth a visit for anybody that's looking to get inspired. I definitely am going to take a few things away from this. Absolutely brilliant. Well done, sir. Really, really good base. But yeah, not a very long video, I know, guys. I do apologise, but it was just, it's just the wow factor of that. Like I say, absolutely fantastic. Well done. We're going to be uh, popping out some more videos and doing some more bits and bobs in the new year. So hopefully, we will catch you all soon. But for now, take care of yourselves, and we will see you soon. Thank you very much. Goodbye. Thank you very much for watching the video, everybody. We really hope you enjoyed it. If you did, then please consider giving the channel a like and a subscribe. Hit the bell notification as well to keep up to date with everything that we're doing. We really appreciate those likes and subscribe, guys. They keep us going. Thank you so much. We just want to take a second to say thank you to our Creative Club members and also our Creative Club graduates that you can see on the screen now. You guys are rock and rollers. Thank you so much. If you want to join the membership, uh, hit the button below. Come over and join the members club with us. Uh, every single member will get a free Adventures of Murray comic and all sorts of other little bits and bobs that we throw in there as well. So it's really worth it, guys. But uh, if you want to support the channel, like it, subscribe it, don't skip the ads. You're really helping us out. We appreciate every single last one of you and we look forward to seeing you in the next video. So for now, take care, guys. We'll see you soon.